ចាស់ទស្សនីជនជាទីមេត្រីប្រធានសម្ព័ន្ធអ្នកសង្កេតការបោះឆ្នាំ Campuchia គោរពមិននៅសេរីភាពនៃការបញ្ចេញមតិរបស់អ្នកបោះឆ្នោត IAEO ដែលមានទីស្នាក់ការកណ្ដាលនៅទីក្រុងប៉ារីសលោកលូកាស៊ីអូបានបញ្ជាក់តាមរយៈវីដេអូផ្លូវការមួយថាដោយដែលដែលនេះជាសក្តិភាពបញ្ជាក់ពីភាពរងមមស្មរតីរបស់ប្រជាពលរដ្ឋលោកបានបញ្ជាក់ថាយើរ excellencies in my capacity as president i am speaking on behalf of the international alliance of electoral observers whose headquarters are in paris we are independent observers and we were invited to observe the compliance with cambodian law and in practice how the ballot was conducted in the election process held on 23rd July. First of all, let me underline that, uh, as we stated in our declaration, in the days leading up to the elections, we noted a high level of public mobilization, which was expressed in a calm and sometimes even festive atmosphere. The National uh, Election Committee took part in a meeting to present the terms and procedures of the ballot which enabled a clear understanding of the rules and the election monitoring measures. The day of election, we visited nearly a dozen polling stations' desks between 6 a.m. and the close of the poll at 3 p.m. At our request, we were able to visit five polling stations instead of three. The materials and information made available to voters were clear and comprehensive. It is worth noting the strong commitment of the staff dedicated to the voting operations, who carried out the relevant tasks with initiative and motivation. New IT tools were put in place to ensure better monitoring of counting operations. The polling stations were perfectly accessible and manned by a sensor who had taken an oath, which is a guarantee of seriousness and commitment. The voting took place in the presence of national observers in each polling stations and the votes counted according to the usual standards. It was impossible for us to be in the thousands of polling stations throughout the country, so we cannot give an estimation for invalid or blank ballots to young voters. Nevertheless, we observed in the polling stations that we visited a few blank or invalid ballots, not many in number, which seems to be irrelevant for influencing the final results. Turnout was high, particularly among young voters. This is a testament to the vitality of civic mindedness. We were able to speak freely with people, with voters who understood what was at stake in the elections. And we took care of the counting, which took place under the eyes of the representative of the political parties. And of many international observers. In conclusion, we con can consider that Cambodian law in, on candidacies, the presentation of the parties and the conduct of the ballot were respected as well as the freedom of expression of voters and that the ballot was sincere and transparent. It is not our, our intention to interfere in international conflict or controversies over the participation or otherwise of a particular political party. As international observers, we cannot neither interfere in the proclamation of the results. Our independence obliges us to be reserved. The Alliance is the right to have been able to verify that the major principle of universal law have been respected. Democracy is a work in progress and can only continue to improve. Thank you very much.
ក៏មិនចាត់ថាសំពន្ធអ្នកសង្កេតកាបោះឆ្នោតអន្តរជាតិ IAEO គឺជាអ្នកសង្កេតការឯករាជ្យដែលត្រូវបានអញ្ចេ